Now, I have been a lifelong Mortal Kombat fan for, well, my whole life, actually. I literally started playing when I was probably like five, which is weird because game's not for kids. Or my parents thinking, actually. But I'm here to play the story. I have played Invasion Mode entirely on Xbox already with the uh, the premium edition. I got one for here to record and they got one on Xbox because I just typically prefer... Well, I got it... No, I got it to play with somebody, then found out that we can't cross-play between Xbox and PlayStation, which sucks. But I still like that I have it because I love this game. I have incurred a couple of spoilers, though, which I did not like. I, I'm fine with the story details. I just don't like being spoiled. But that's my own fault for even touching the game in the first place. I'll do a medium. Why does, wait, why does story have test your might? I don't know, I don't care. I'm just glad, I'm glad to finally get into this. It's so hard not to pick story mode for so long. My friends, your patience is about to be rewarded. For I have saved the best for last. I have recently discovered a cure-all of unrivaled potency. It will soon be on the shelves in every home of Outworld. This elixir is crafted from an ancient recipe. It has Patreon flowers. Margot Patreon? Powder teeth of an Austin Shang Tsung's on Patreon? All this and more, infused with powerful Lycorian magic. There is a village in the next canton over. Where everyone has purchased this miracle cure. What is a canton? Overnight, all diseases, even Tarkat, have disappeared. Now, magic this potent is expensive. You can't and expect I'm them sure to believe that kind of a promise. Can I afford it? But the true question you must ask is, can I afford to be without it? You lie, Shang Tsung. Your cures are useless. Damn, you're well voice acted for someone who's I'm not sorry. in the credits. You are. Someone fool enough to have believed you. My daughter was dying when you came to my farm. You promised a miracle, and I gave you all I had. But only days later... She was dead. <laughs> that is impossible. My magic could not have failed her. There was no magic! I took your elixir to an Imperial mage, and you know what she said? It's nothing! Just Borjang tea! The mage is mistaken, kind sir. My elixirs are of superior quality. Their efficacy is guaranteed. <laughs> That was a quick one. See you next era, Shang Tsung. I mean, I've seen this because this was all over before the game even released. I don't know why they released this opening scene early, but they did. It wasn't a leak. It was official, I'm pretty sure. Nice pointy boots. Oh yeah, worked like a charm. Backwater folk are far more likely to trust a kindly old man. You're on behalf of a dissatisfied customer. If it's revenge you want, have at it. If it's restitution, there's nothing left. What I want, Shang Tsung, is to elevate you. To make you the great sorcerer that now you can only pretend to be. A generous offer. Why me? You are uniquely resilient. Who else could eke out a living traveling Outworld's hinterlands, selling quack cures and fake magic? <laughs> a living? 
It is barely survival. And you were meant for more. To live among kings, not peasants. But since before you were born, you have been conspired against by those who fear how formidable you could become. How do you know this? Who are you? I am your deliverer, Shang Tsung. Join me, and I will put the realms at your feet. Work for you, Kronika. Work like a charm. Yeah. Don't... How much do I have to pay? What's your price to, like, never look at me like that again? I'll pay it. I, I swear, whatever it is. Uh, this is a good harvest, Kung Lao. Yes. It is a blessing, Raiden. You would rather we starve? No, no, of course not. But we've worked these fields since we were kids. In 40 years, we'll still be here. Stooped and feeble like old man Wei. <laughs> as long as I've known you, you've dreamed of leaving Fengjian. Why can't you be happy here? Our ancestors fought in great wars. They died with honor and glory. Stories of our great adventures <laughs> will be passed down for generations. It may not be glorious, but what we do helps the village thrive. I know. But is it so wrong to want some excitement? Yes. If that's what you want, may I suggest a bet? Dinner at Madame Beau's tonight. Last to fill their cart pays. You work faster than me? Ha! Since when? You're on, Raiden. The man simply could not have known what he was f***ing with. Okay, I like that. I want more moments like that in, in the story modes of Mortal Kombat. Or chill time. Kind of break up the action. Develop the characters. That is amazing. I am starving. I wonder what Madame Bo is making tonight. For you two, whatever you want. Thank you, Madame Bo. You spoil us. Like the sons I never had. Have you two been practicing my lessons? As we can. The harvest leaves us little time for martial arts. Since your first words, Kung Lao, you've mouthed nothing but excuses. If you fail to prepare... Your preparations will fail you. Good. You haven't forgotten. But we'll see if I make you anything special tonight. I'm glad you're paying. Madame Bo might just pad the bill with her anger. I am paying? You finished work last. But I delivered my cart first. Delivered? Huh. The bet was filled. That's not what I remember. So that's how it is, eh? What do you say we settle this man-to-man? -man? Hmm? Actually, Kung Lao is right. He did say filled. <laughs> Wait, you mean fight? Ref says. Yes. Ref says. Right here, right now. It was filled. Madame Bo can watch. Critique our form. Don't worry, I've seen the TikTok. Two out of three? She'll get Fair hers. Enough. We must be careful. Madame Bo will kick us out if we break something. <laughs> oh, this won't last long enough for that to happen. You will be down in no time. Oh yeah, what's that then? Wait, I haven't played any Kung Lao. <laughs> I don't know how Kung Lao works. Hold on. Oh yeah, I wouldn't have any hat moves or teleports because he's still wearing the stupid straw hat. Let's 
So, do you have no cameos in story mode just at all? I have no idea how how Kung Lao is. I spent most of my time playing smoke. Wait, that looked like the beginning of something. I am only helped by the power to stop time and look at my moves. You see, Madam Bo. Finish him. You haven't beaten me yet. The day's coming, Kung Lao. Finish him. <laughs> Keep telling yourself that. <laughs> you were hungry. <laughs> oh, everything was delicious, Madam Bo. Thank you, Raiden. You boys are always a pleasure to cook for. Oh, here it comes. Madam Bo, the Lin Kuei await your answer. I have been busy, Smoke. The Lin Kuei? Who are they? Don't know, but I don't like where this is going. What do we do? Stay ready. Madam Bo, it is a simple choice. Pay for our protection or risk harm to this fine establishment. You'll get nothing from me. Here it comes. That, Madam Bo is unfortunate. That Madam Bo is unfortunate. <laughs> Madam Bo! I think I hit my mic when I did that. <laughs> or my mic arm. Pay for our protection, or these hands are rated E for everyone. You two are brave, but against us, you are in over your head. We don't care who you are or who you are with. You will not menace Matt Bo. Fight. <laughs> So, in this game, it kind of seems like Smoke is supposed to be super young. Is Smoke only, like, 20 in this? Oh, it was B, not A. Okay, got it. Ow. Do something. Do something. After that? Oh, I can, but I don't know what my air combos are. But he goes full on Majima. Just Goro Majima when he gets up, he just now who's in over his head. This was you? Honestly, I'm surprised too. Come on, let's help Madame Bo. We need to put your life in danger more often. Just gonna stand there. How does he do that? You hurt our good boy. We can't have that. You interfere with Lin Kuei business. Leave! Or face our wrath. Abandon Madame Bo. Not happening. <laughs> I'm 
gonna tackle you. I, that is not canonically what this man sounds like. It's fine in gameplay, but that's not. Want more? I have plenty. That was not the same voice actor. Prepare to regret ever crossing the Lin Kuei. Fight. Oh wait, I have a cameo? Raiden cameo? There we go, there is how the combos start. It's easy when you're in the corner. got some smarm to him. God, I will find out my air combos. That's my goal, to learn Kung Lao's air combo without having to look it up. Why are you giving him the ice armor? I don't have my projectile yet. Do I? Can I throw my tiny hat? My bad hat? Crossing me. Jesus. I did not realize we were extorting monkeys. There was a perfectly ice cube shaped portion of it. Incompetent. Oh, that works. I have had enough of you. Then go before I put you down like the rest of your Lin Kuei. You haven't a prayer against the Lin Kuei's Grand Master. Fight. Well, maybe the Lin Kuei's Grandmaster should teach his subordinates better. Because they went down pretty easy. Like, I didn't even have to do a mob fight or anything. Oh, I got one. YX, probably YX and Y or YXA. <laughs> Can any of you link? Oh god. Yep. Yeah, probably wait till he's out cold. Adversity. I only have two special moves. It's canon, just trust me. <laughs> Are you sure you're a grandmaster? Straight over the ice ball. Interesting. Kung Lao, over here! She's dead. She is very dead. She's out cold. Oh no, is she dead? Not yet. Of course. Madam Bo, how are you? Come now. She reminds me of the um 
the landlady from Kung Fu Hustle. <laughs> so, Madame Bo, are they ready? A bit thick in the head, perhaps, but they are ready. His eyes are glowing. I am Lord Liu Kang, God of Fire and Protector of Earthrealm. God? Earthrealm? Madame Bo has been preparing you for this moment since you were boys. Today, you have proven worthy of joining my champions. This fight was... a test? Of your ability and character, yes. Li Han, Kui Liang. Who is Smoke? Say what Smoke's name is. What is his first name? So I've heard people say that he's Hanzo Hasashi, and I don't believe it. Whether or not I like it isn't the problem. I just don't believe it. So these two aren't thugs? The Lin Kuei is a centuries-old clan dedicated to Earthrealm's defense. You keep saying Earthrealm. Don't you mean Earth? You boys have so much to learn. Earth is only a part of Earthrealm. Earthrealm itself is one of many realms. Together, they comprise the whole of the universe. The realms can be fierce, bitter rivals. That's why we need champions to defend ours. The time draws near for the Grand Martial Arts Tournament between Earthrealm and the Realm of Outworld. Held once each century, it allows each realm to demonstrate its strength. While our realms are at peace, there are Outworlders who would prefer us to be at war. Our victory in the tournament will temper their zeal. I've taught you everything I can. You must finish your training with Lord Liu Kang. More training? These two couldn't defeat us. <laughs> <laughs> what? They were pulling their punches. Had we not held back, you would not have survived. Come. The monks at the Wuxi Academy await to continue your tutelage. I am ready, Lord Liu Kang. And you, Raiden? Behan, you got a little... You got a little... Lee Feng Jian? Yeah, I'm needed here. Earth Realm needs you, Raiden. Just a thought. You serve the village by being one of its champions. I understand. Excellent. I will join you soon. First, there are other champions I must gather. I like that bird. Oh, just right into the big stuff. We're off the map. We should go back, recheck the route. It's this way. So we are definitely on a movie set, right? 100%. Going right back to the 95 movie. <sighs> Delicious. Uncharted 5 looking pretty good. Never actually played that series because the first one kind of bored me with all the gunfights. Just the sheer amount of them. I've been told there's an achievement in one of them called Ludo Narrative Dissonance for how many guards that guy can hire. Because in each fight, you kill like at least. 10 or 15 of them, and there's like a hundred fights throughout the game. And we're definitely getting warmer. Huh. 
How are these still burning? Oil bubbles up from the ground. The chamber channels it somehow. They're keeping this going for a long time. I clicked the wrong story mode. God, Ravala and his shield. What? So there's metal in the floor. It's not just any metal. It's liquid mercury. Shit, that stuff's toxic. Fatal. Only step where I step. He's going face first in there. Huh? What did I say? <laughs> and a fight has to happen, which is why that character looks suspiciously havoc shaped. I'm, I'm sure it's a coincidence. Not now. I'll kick your ass later. Get out the explosives. That's our bridge. Do this right, it'll fall across. Take care of the sheep. That is not how flight mechanics work. What? Huh? Should I go grab a snack? I even turned down the graphics. I want to point that out. I even turned down the graphics because I thought something like this might happen. I know it probably didn't look like it, but I did. Well, that was convenient. It's, oh, it's fake Natara. I still say that the body up there looks very havocy. For the record, I've actually never played fucking Johnny Cage either, so. Wow, really gonna be a minute before I get into the stuff I know. Was that a red carpet? Hold on, I thought it was a blood splatter. It's gotta... It works good enough for me. All of the kicks. Hey, since you're technically already dead, can I fatality you? Can I uppercut your head off? You okay? Yes, we ready? Physics for the win. Let's go. Shoot, that body looks more like classic Havoc than new Havoc looks. It belongs in a museum. We're getting kind of close. 
you're you're cutting it a little close here. Damn, I'm amazed that they actually killed him. Hey, he's got the Morning Star. Now put it in game, please. I do like New Havoc, but I was disappointed that he didn't have the Morning Star. Morning Star. You're dead. Speaking of which, you just killed my best friend, and I'm not one to forgive and forget. Oh, okay then. Ugh. Somehow it's grosser when this dude does it than it is when Havoc does it. Would Mercury actually do that? Somebody tell me, because I don't I don't think it does. Wait, what was that? I just did an actual thing. Damn, it'll never happen again. I can't use cage time because I'm not, because I'm in the movie. Now where's that shield? I'm not yet defeated. Yes, you are. Okay. Okay, Captain America. Cut. Credit. I knew it. I felt that one. You felt it too, right? Temple of Kataravala. It's upside down. Tail slayed. That's a wrap. Steven, this book horse. Is Thank you. Horse's name is Steven. Oh, just like the old days. And these props. Jimbo killed it. <laughs> You did too, Johnny. Hey, uh, about my pitch. You know, the karate zombie thing? I'm thinking four films. Maybe a streaming series? Johnny, I don't have... You're right. Not here. I'll swing by your office after I change. Mm, I can't. Uh, have to be with the editors. Marsha will call you. Damn. Cutthroat. Wait. Have your assistant call me. Well, that was great, Han. Wasn't it, though? We need to celebrate. I'm thinking private party. But, Johnny, we need to talk. Is Johnny married? Is he about to not be? You're not the martial arts megastar you once were, honey. You're lucky Steven owed you a favor. I'm telling you, Chris, we're fine. Can you join me in the fact-based universe just once? We're broke. We have to cut back. Cut back? On what? Step one is still in this place. Mm. I need a refill. He did mention selling this house in invasion mode. Keep this up. You spent 10000 on that sculpture, 30000 on that drone, and this damn sword. Three million dollars? Hey, Cento is history. That sword comes from... Ugh, that's not the point, Johnny! Chris, honey, the parts, the money, they're coming. Steven's movie is just the beginning. That's why I can't cut back. To be a success, I have to project it. If I don't, Johnny Cage is done. Is that a stage name? I didn't marry Johnny Cage. I married John Carlton. I'd give anything to have him back. Chris, come on, Chris, where are you going? Out. Fuck. 
Way to relieve the tension. Kind of wish they just left to be quiet. I actually really like his sword. The one that's not sent out to. What did you Your wife left. She's fine. You will be too if you cooperate. What do you want? What, did you just pass her? Kinda wish they showed them passing on the driveway, just being like, hey. Or do you know Sento's history? I know it. It's my family blade. No. No way, your Tyra clan. They've been dead for centuries. Not dead. Hiding. With Sento in my hands, I'll lead us out of the shadows. That's a great plan, stranger. Except for one thing. Sento's mine. Cutscene. And I won't give it up without Cutscene. You got it? <laughs> there we go. Fight. Yay, I can use it. I can use the thing. We. I know one combo. I gotta use A and B more, because the kicks really are always like the bread and butter of Johnny Cage. Okay, I'll stop it. I'll stop using. Stop reacting well. Ow. Hold on, I'm getting my ass kicked. I've gotten my ass kicked. throw come on one throw one one throw one throw one throw no really one throw one throw there we go one throw you tried robbing the wrong house i am the ultimate home security Come on. God, the Ty- whatever he called you, Tyga Clan? Tyro Clan? Whatever it is, it's not gonna be dead, but it can't continue. My rules. So, you have a name or what? Kenshi Takahashi. <laughs> I knew you weren't Tyra Clan. You know nothing, Cage. 400 years ago, the Tyra Clan were one of Japan's first families. They lost Sento after getting slaughtered at the siege of Aomori. There were survivors. They hid themselves by shedding the name Tyra for Takahashi. They joined the Bakuto for its protection. The Yakuza's predecessors. From first family to crime family. I will break us free of the Yakuza's corruption, reclaim our name and our position. But my clan won't follow me unless I prove that I can lead. That's why I need Sento. And that's Malibu's finest. It's a great story. Bullshit. <laughs> but great. You should seriously consider becoming a screenwriter. What in the actual fuck? Good evening, Johnny Cage. Alibu's finest. I am Liu Kang, protector of Earthrealm. May we enter? Uh, nothing's being shot here tonight. Uh, you sure you're in the right place? Yes. We come on a matter of grave importance. We must speak to you and your guest. What? How do you know about him? Because I am the god of fire. Might want to show him something. Nicely done. 
Sure. I, I, come right in. Glowing eyes are a nice touch. I don't think that makeup artists can do glowing eyes. A tragic figure with a noble cause. Your actions this evening do you no credit. Who are these people? You tell me. They're <laughs> your scene partners. I also know of your struggles, Johnny Cage. I am here to offer you both a path forward. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> oh, come on, guys, let's call this. Chris was a doll to set this up, but as pranks go, this one's a bit obvious. This is no prank. Bihar, Kualiang, if you please. God, I hate when they do this. Right. Show him powers. Just, I'll just fire ice. Uh, and he's no longer confused. You get what you paid for. Uh. <clears throat> okay. Uh. Hey, you. Uh. Wait, wait, wait. Hey, you. Get your damn hands off him. I said, get your hands off him. <laughs> <laughs> Was that necessary, brother? To put him in his place. That was a Hicholi. One of a kind. All right, I don't care if this is a damn prank. You cross the line. Fight. But it's not. I do love that wherever Bihan goes, Ice follows. In his movement, I mean, it's just... Sorry, I, I was watching the cutscene. I like forgot I was even here. Forgot what I was doing. Come on. Oh, you're in the corner. I know how to do one exact thing in the corner. It'd be screwed harder if I knew the rest of that combo. Come on. I have never seen anyone sweep somebody with their arm before like that. <laughs> I learned a thing. Well, why do you get a cameo and I don't? Also, what's that thing underneath Scorpion's portrait? I don't know what that is. Overhead. Bang. <laughs> nice try, but I have an armor move. I hope you're insured, because you're paying for my Julie. Imbecile. You have no idea with whom you're dealing. Enough. Yeah, you should should have led with that. That's no special effect. Indeed, Johnny Cage. Liang. Okay, let's go back to one here. Who are you again? Lord Liu Kang, protector of Earthrealm, god of fire. Well, that last one tracks. But what's an Earthrealm? All will be explained, Johnny Cage. For now, what is important is that you both have been chosen to join its champions. Why him? Or me, for that matter. Because I have faith that you will rise to the challenge. And because your service will change the arcs of your lives. I actually like that. The idea that Johnny is doing this to get, get his life back on track so his wife won't leave him. It actually humanizes the character a little bit. A oh, nice touch. I like that. And I also like... That people who don't participate in Mortal Kombat don't know about the concept of Earthrealm. They just know it as Earth like a regular person. I think I also like that. Somebody tell me what I think.
That is not a good idea. <laughs> He's a genius, Raiden. The next time we see Sub Zero, I will have to thank him for inspiring it. Ow! See? It won't be effective. Maybe it's too effective. Uh, we just need to get on with it. I've been cooped up here for months. I can't base a cinematic universe on Outworld's monsters and magic if I don't ever see them. That's why you're here? Liu Kang said this gig would change the arc of my life. That's how it gets done. My aunt's will rue the day she gave up on me. I guess the Elder Gods haven't kept up with laws regarding technology. Oh, please, Tattoo. You're just here to get your sword back. We all have our reasons for being here. Some better than others. But we are not here to fight among ourselves. We are here to fight for Earthrealm. It's about damn time. And today, one of you will be chosen to fight for it at the tournament. Only one of us, Lord Liu Kang? Isn't Outworld fielding several champions? The tournament's rules give the host realm that advantage. And it is Outworld's turn as host. You know, I don't know why I've never asked this, but, uh, <laughs> what's our record at this tournament? Earthrealm and Outworld have long been evenly matched, but Outworld is gaining strength. Should it win, its more militant factions will be emboldened. I thought you admired Outworld. It is a place of great knowledge, wealth, and beauty. Now, but now it is. We do not share goals and beliefs. We coexist peacefully. Because Outworld respects our strength. Should we show weakness, our rival will become our enemy. I will not lose, Lord Liu Kang. First, you must win the right to represent us. Whichever one of you outlasts the others will be chosen. And Kung Lao call him Lord is just kind of weird. Raiden, step forward. <laughs> Good call. Call the weak first. You shall face him, Johnny Cage. Ready for your close-up? All right, let's do this. But remember, oh yeah, I guess I am still fighting as Johnny. Martial arts icon. I don't think you can handle this much boom. <laughs> I am ready, Johnny Cage. <laughs> Is he feels the cringe? Even gods feel the cringe. Oh, wait, I'm raided now. Did I miss the card that came up saying it was Raiden's turn? Wait, no lightning? I don't have lightning? Oh, boy. Wait, that's three characters in a row that don't have their special abilities. I'm sensing a pattern. You'll never see the next, you'll never see the next high kick coming, I swear. Just trust me, just turn around. I promise it'll be different. High kick, high kick. Low kick, high kick, high kick. One throw. Oh, I forward threw and I don't have a cameo. By the way, just if you haven't yet, if you own this game and you haven't yet, Pick Shujinko as your cameo when you're fighting Katana. Just do it. Just trust me. Just do it. I don't... Uh, I don't have Thunder Tackle. I want Thunder Tackle. This fight was an honor. This thing is... This game is absolutely destroying my PC. Kenshi <laughs> Takahashi. You are next. Isn't that an advantage? You have skills, Raiden, but you're inexperienced. Whatever experience I lack, I make up for in heart. It's nerve, not heart, that wins fights. I should know. I've been in hundreds of them. Fight. It's hard, I'll take it. it. 
Oh, yeah. Do I have any special moves? Because pretty much all of Raiden's special moves are based around his lightning abilities. So no teleport, no lightning tackle, no thunderbolts, no circle thing, whatever it's called. God, just let me suck on an internet modem or something and get some powers back. I shouldn't have taken you lightly. I won't do it again. Ow. Ow. Okay, falling falling back to the original strat. You do have to mix it up a little, or the AI will actually learn. I say as I get my ass handed to me. I wasn't messing up the combo. I was applying uh, block pressure. That's all it was. Just applying some block pressure. Do you still question my nerve? I do not. Yours was a well-earned victory. You may rest, Raiden. This evening, you will face your final opponent. And his fancy new hat. So did he just walk up to the blacksmith and was just like, all right, uh, question. Can you do a circle? 50 bucks says Kung Lao wins. Make it interesting. Bet me Sento. <laughs> Not on your life. Raiden, Kung Lao. The winner of this match will represent Earthrealm against Outworld. It is a grave duty. Not to be undertaken lightly. You may step back now and suffer no dishonor. You will suffer this pride, though. Oh, Liu Kang. As do I. Then may the best person win. Can I get a fucking cushion? You have never beaten me. That won't change today. No. If the monks have taught us one thing, it's that the only constant in the universe is change. Fight! How long was Raiden's rest? It's night time now. Hold on, did I learn things? Oh, better cut back on that. I almost looked like I knew what I was doing. Just for a second. Like lightning. You won't strike twice, but I will give you one throw. Oh, no, he gave me one throw. One throw. Oh, come on, that landed. One throw. Ow. That was a painful thing that you just did, and I want to point out that is against the rules. I win. I win by default. Can he not be thrown? I, I could swear that some of these throws are landing. I'm just saying. One throw.
You can't beat my high kick. There is a first time for everything, Kung Lao. That's a pretty... Although you have all trained well, Raiden has excelled. This outcome does not surprise me. Damn! How could I have... Congratulations, Raiden. For the tournament, you will need this. Hey, it's the MK9 amulet! Forged by the Elder Gods. It gives the wearer power over lightning and thunder. Go ahead. Try it. So does it infuse him with lightning and thunder power, or is it just like is it just like a Navi that he wears? <laughs> I do love the idea that Johnny is just recording everything on his phone. Incredible. Oh, that's going on the talk. In addition to possessing great might, the outworlders you will face also wield great magic. The amulet levels the playing field. You must be careful, Raiden. You could get hurt, even killed. No tournament participant has ever been grievously injured or killed. <laughs> oh, son. I send my champions unwittingly into mortal combat. Oh, see, I'm not sure you know what franchise you're a part of. For Outworld's capital, Sundo. The tournament will be held at the palace of Empress Sindel. Okay, but what if this is, like, just a really, really expensive prank? Outworld can be both alien and intoxicating to Earthrealmers. Do not become drawn in. You must focus on the task at hand. You don't... You don't need a flashlight. Why was your flashlight on? This is the exact opposite of something that you need a flash for. Wait, who was that last person? Who was the guy running in with the box? Toto, I have a feeling we're not Kansas anymore. Oh my. Are those Empress Sindel's daughters? Yes. They do not disappoint. We are Earthrealm's ambassadors, Johnny. We'll show them respect, not unwanted attention. Ugh, I hate that character trait so much. But I suppose it is a consistent one. Lord Liu Kang, welcome. Thank you, Princess Melina. You remember my sister? Of course, Princess Kitana. May I introduce Johnny? Never Kong, heard of her. Kung Lao, Kenshi Takahashi, and Earthrealm's champion, Raiden. I hope you're prepared, Raiden. Our champions are determined to win. None more so than me. It's been too long since we've known victory. Princess Melina, we should be on our way. Empress Sindel awaits. Thanks, Sojourn. Tanya, follow me, please. As definitely Sodorn. I don't I don't recognize a lot of voices outright, but I know that one. I love all of the purples. And Shokan. The six armed beings are not Nodens. Wait, were there not Nodens there? Them, but seeing them in person? I see that Her Majesty once again spares no expense on the festival. Should she not? It commemorates my late father. I admire, Princess. I do not judge. As did all of Outworld, I valued greatly Jared's fellowship. <laughs> Oh, are we getting Lee May? Hey! Don't 
don't arrest people in front of my cart. First constable, our route was to be clear. This couldn't wait. Should I allow Tarkatans to infect the city, your highness? Those arrested were harboring some here, rather than report them for quarantine. The Earth Realmers cannot be privy to our secrets, Li Mei. As Sundo's first constable, you must show better judgment. Perhaps that's too much to expect. Oof. I wasn't aware Molina was so rude. He doesn't seem to like her very much. Li Mei used to lead the Umgadi, the palace guard. It was on her watch that the princess's father was murdered. I honestly did not expect him to tell him that. Well, I guess you do what you want when you're God. Spends energy for no purpose, Rin. But the tournament, if I lose... Focus on your actions, not the outcome. It is all you can control. Damn, he's actually spitting wisdom out here. Real wisdom. Red alert. Incoming stock villain. General Shaw. He's not wrong. Do not let him go to you. <laughs> is it me? Or is Earth Realm's champion scrawnier than usual? You look like something the Doomslayer would fight. Raided will will prove himself soon enough. Have you still not told most Earth Realmers that Outworld exists? It is safer that way, General. I suppose so. Your people's frail minds couldn't handle the truth. You presume them frail, General. Should you, given how frequently they win this tournament? We will destroy your champion, Liu Kang. He will taste no victory. General Butthurt. Welcome, members of the royal house. God, I love how purple everything is. Our esteemed Earth Realm guests. We gather once again to honor my late husband's legacy. To continue the tournament that he founded with Lord Liu Kang in hopes that it would foster peace among realms. Good luck with that. May Jared's soul watch over us with pride from its resting place in the living forest. So the rest of so the living forest is a graveyard now? Empress That's an interesting spin. Pleases me to once again be your guest. Here, you are always welcome. Now, let us meet your champion. Earthrealm's champion is Raiden, your majesty. He has earned his place by embodying the very best qualities of Earthrealm's people. You seem nervous, young man. I'm a stranger in an unfamiliar land, here to compete against its greatest fighters. Yes, I am nervous. As you should be. Is that sass? You have a difficult path ahead. It has begun. Ah, oh, she said the thing! She said the thing! Tradition requires. Outworld's initial competitor will be Sundo's first constable. Li Mei. May she defend our realm's glory as well as she preserves our capital's order. Probably a little better, actually. Your Majesty, I will honor both the Royal House and all of Outworld with my combat. If so, you will vastly exceed my expectations. Remember, were it not for Jared's tradition, you would not be here. Damn, for a place with so much natural lighting, there is a lot of shade being thrown. Is your best. The Are you sure Noob's not in this game? Yes, Lord Liu Kang. Shall we see what you can do? 
Hopefully, this will be the first of many victories. I will prevail, Earthrealmer. This fight is more important to me than you can ever know. Oof, sorry, not your chapter. Yet. I don't think. She she must have a chapter, right? She's not a villain. Oh wait, I have abilities now. Tackle! 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 Oh, yeah. Oh, it really tested me. Took out a whole quarter of my health bar. <laughs> Lightning elemental. That's a... They've chosen some interesting angles to make sure you get cameos during some of these fights. Tackle. And... Tackle! You left yourself open to being tackled. for the match first constable so i get one fight with the lightning powers i mean to be fair i didn't even get one with kung lao's hat so she looks so sad i mean i guess she would be if you can to be fair my compliments raiden on a well-fought match we'll see how you fare in the next general shao whom have you chosen as our next competitor? Your Majesty, I have chosen Reiko, my second in command. As a boy, Reiko was orphaned during the Kafala War. He didn't give Lee May a bio. His spirit remained unbroken. He scratched, clawed, and survived. After the war, I took him in molded him into the perfect soldier. Few others are as well versed in the ways of war. He can also do a high kick. What army have you served? In what wars have you fought? I have done neither. Then you are woefully unprepared, Earthrealmer. This will be your last battlefield. Uh, didn't Liu Kang say no one was ever grievously injured? Damn, I actually kind of schmixed him for a second. realized holy crap I am a warrior. all right i'm gonna get through this chapter and then i'm gonna call that an episode because i just realized i've been playing for a pretty long time although a lot of that was waiting on the johnny cage chapter to actually load Hey, I use tackle. Yeah, you, did you think you're getting out without any tackles? Oh, you're getting tackled. You're getting tackled to death. No, I pressed tackle, not forward kick. Ah. Felled by a simple farmer. I am ready for my next opponent, your majesty. Whom shall I face? Patience, young man. We are adjourned until first light. I hope to see you all at this evening's banquet. All right, I don't think there's like interludes between this story, so I'm going to cut it there and I'm going to call this an episode. I will continue this tomorrow every day once I get the first episode out every single day until it is over. All right, because I've been gone way too long and I've got PTO. 
finally have some time, I promise I will actually make good on the fact that this channel even exists. Because I can't stand the fact that my most viewed video is literally just me bowling a nine. It's literally, it's, it's just me walking up and bowling and getting a nine. It's not even a strike and it's my most viewed video. <laughs> There's no joke or anything either. I was really confused. Uh, but I'll see you next time. Please like, comment, subscribe, do whatever you want. Tell me how much I suck at fighting games because they've given me no characters I've spent any time with on the Xbox version. As of yet, eventually. We'll get, we'll get there. We'll get there. But you'll know. I won't say it. You'll know when we get there. And until then, I'll see you all in the next one. That's not my outro. My outro is Charge 6 signing out.